For the first time, thousands of live mosquitoes are being released in a Sacramento neighborhood to help prevent disease. It's happening in a designated 100 acre zone of South Natomas, where crews just released thousands of the bugs. It's a new program we first told you about last month. Now tonight we're getting answers on how these lab grown insects can help stop invasive mosquitoes from spreading and getting reaction from people who live there. A new way to fight the bite. We are launching officially the release of our serial mail program to help control invasive mosquitoes that are rapidly spreading. Officials from Sacramento's Mosquito Control District opened containers with 15,000 live mosquitoes Tuesday, setting the bugs free. The mosquitoes are raised in a Kentucky lab and treated with a bacteria that's harmless to humans but makes the insects unable to breed. And when these male mosquitoes, which don't bite, when they mate with the wild females, the resulting eggs don't hatch. The swarm is being released in Sacramento's South Natomas area, a neighborhood where a large number of invasive mosquitoes have been detected that can cause diseases like Zika and dengue fever. Yeah, I get it frustrated because I can go out of, out of my house. We're close to the river and the, the levee, so you know it comes with the territory. Marvin Watt saw the crews on his block and thought they were setting traps to kill mosquitoes. When we told him what they were really doing, he was surprised they were releasing stairs insects. Now I got a problem with it. I didn't know that. Thank you for telling me that. I did not know that. He's concerned this new program won't work. That doesn't make no sense to me. You're killing mosquitoes, but then you want to do another experiment to release sterilized mosquitoes. Mosquito abatement officials say a total of 400,000 mosquitoes will eventually be released between now and November over a 100 acre area of South Natomas. The program costs just over $32,000 and if it's successful, mosquitoes could also be released in other parts of Sacramento and Yolo counties. We do hope to see a reduction of invasive mosquitoes and thus protect public health in this area. Now you'll see more bug battling tomorrow in Citrus Heights and Upperland Park. Mosquito control crews will do ground spraying starting in just a few hours, 2 a.m. until 6. Comes after increased West Nile virus and more mosquitoes. Crews will be out in trucks or with backpacks spraying in neighborhoods, specifically around parks and creeks.